It's, it's going to be a unique year. It's you know you, I, I've never been on a, a coach the team that you have one senior, one junior who's a first year guy, and, and our best players are, are sophomores and, and Kyle Lachine and, and Dom. Um, you know, so it's I think one of the reasons why we've had some success is that guys get better every year. Um, most guys get better, and you know Dom and, and Kyle and, and Shun, they got to take that next step. Their leadership has to be that much better. We relied last year on Courtney and, and Ladarian, and now we, you know, we, we've got 19-year-old leaders, you know, which is a concern. I think if you talk to any coach in the country, you would want, you know, senior leadership, not not sophomore leadership. But these three guys are really talented. Um, they've been through it last year. Um, you know, Kyle played probably the, maybe the most minutes of any freshman in the country. So, um, you know, they're, they're, they're experienced, uh, and, and we're going to rely on those guys to, to lead us. Kyle had one of the best freshman years that I've that I had as a player uh, in terms of coaching him. Um, you know, came from no be- nowhere. Um, no one really knew who he was. And, um, you know, I think that it, it's funny. It's, you know, he was a, a pass first point guard coming out of. Uh, um, prep school and even out of high school and he just he, when we got hurt it was really important for him to take on that that scoring role and which he did last year and um, Dom's the same way he got hurt the first eight games um, you know came back and, and really did a, a terrific job for us uh, I, I think sometimes Western New York gets uh, a bad rap uh, they don't have a lot of high school players and so forth and you know it's you know it's great and I think it's good for the community good for this area to, ha- to have two guys on the team that are that are successful Division One players, and um, you know, hopefully, I said, like I said, that Amadi has a really good year, and you know, he he really has worked tremendously um, hard on his body to get give himself a chance, and and Dom um, is somebody we feel has a, has a really bright future, and he, he showed glimpses last year, and at times last year he was our best player, um, you know, so two of those guys, you know, both those guys are going to be guys that we're going to rely on, and it's really good that they have, um, you know, they're from this area, and you know, it helps everybody. You have to give uh, Putnam Science uh, and their coaching staff a lot of credit. Um, they run it like a, a college program. Um, you know, those guys are, are coached. Um, they go to class. They're, they're, there's discipline. Um, there's teamwork. It's unselfishness. They're, they're in there not to get their numbers but to win. Um, so, you know, we got two guys that really understood how to play and, and how to win. Um, they're both, you know, great kids um, off the court. Uh, you know, good students. Um, you know, keep their nose clean socially. And then on the car, uh, on the court, they're, they're two guys that are ultra talented. You know, we were four and ten at one point, zero and one in the league. Um, you, know, you know, half our team seemed like they were hurt, um, but those guys kept at it and they they dealt with with you know the negativity. Uh, it didn't get them down. And if someone had told me, you know, we were four and ten and we were coming back from George Mason zero and one, that we would have a shot, one shot. You know, in the corner to go to the NSA tournament, I'd be, you know, I'd tell them they're crazy. Um, but I think it gives our guys confidence. They they've been there, um, they understand what it takes, and I think there's there's a motivation. You know, we didn't finish, uh, so finishing is a, is a, is a big key for us this year. And you know, I I think with the confidence and, and the experience that they've had and what they went through last year, can I got to lead by example. As you know, he just named me one of the captains, so it just shows me that he trusted me to lead by example. So. I just got to do what I got to do on the court and off the court, and then they're following me. Now we know what it takes to get there. We've been there. Um, we fell short, but now it just gives us motivation in the summer, the fall, off season. We just remember that last shot, so it just tells us we can do it. Just uh, put trust in each other, trust in the coaches, and just listen, and we can all buy in. Um, having Shun, I think it helped me off the court. Because, you know, at first when we come in, you don't really know guys, so you're not really comfortable. So he was, like, one of my best friends to start it, and then that was good. And on the court, you know, I love him. Like, he's... He's a great player. Um, I think I see him doing big things. I think it helps us that we have more scorers, more shooters. You know, we got some nice freshmen that can come in and hit shots. Uh, we have Bobby Venutas. He's a good shooter. You know, Dominic Gloves is a good shooter. So I feel like that's going to open the floor up much for me. I can beat my man off the dribble, and we have shooters there. Dump off the shoe, so it helped me a lot. It's it's a big. It was one of the big reasons why I came to Bonaventure. I knew he was coming here, and after what we how we played together at uh, prep school. We, uh, it's like we had an automatic connection playing guard and big, so that was a big help for me. We didn't have a lot of depth last year, a lot of guys, so like now it's like we have threats at every position. We have guys that like we can go deep in our bench if we have to. We have guys that can come in and contribute from the from the get-go, so it's, it's really, really helpful for us. And now that we have a lot more depth on the wing, 
you know, if they get the ball and they come down, I know that I have guys out there who can knock down shots too. I guess in a way you could say the injuries helped us because now we're mature. Not fully, but we know things and we learn quickly. So the injuries just kind of just helped us get smarter and, and be able to teach now. So now this year we can teach the newcomers that don't know everything. And I just feel like the main thing that I've seen just from um, the season starting and me being uh, in the body I am now, it's just, uh, it's just getting that extra uh, mobility, just feeling like lighter, you feel me? Uh, quicker off my feet, whereas I like rebounding, boxing out, and just just overall, I just feel like I'm more uh, agile on the court. I would say number one, just my uh, my approach to uh, this season, just the seriousness, and uh, I would just say my work ethic too. Just uh, I just try to make sure every day I'm uh, one of the guys that's in the gym, like one of the last guys to leave, just make sure every day I can do something individually to uh, help my team when we come together for practice or uh, when the game starts. You definitely can just see it uh, from the things that I see off the court, just like the chemistry, the laughs, just uh, the good times that we have together. But on the court, I'm, um, others can see it too, just like those moments uh, in games where it's just like she like easy uh, assists or it just look like, oh, it looked like they practiced that forever, but really it's just that natural chemistry.